Hello food lovers. Happy to see you again on Yam Chanted. Today I'm going to share a recipe, capsicum paneer chatpata dry, which is literally finger licking. It has vitamin loaded capsicum and protein rich paneer seasoned with chatpata chaat masala. You can make this recipe in a jiffy. So quick and yummy that it will become your favorite food. For this recipe I have used 200 grams capsicum, 180 grams paneer, 140 grams onions, 1 tablespoon ginger cut into julienes, few chilies depending on your spice requirement, 1 tablespoon oil. For seasoning, 1/4 teaspoon dry mango powder, 1/2 a teaspoon chaat masala, 1 teaspoon coriander powder. 1/4 teaspoon turmeric, 1/2 a teaspoon cumin seeds and salt to taste and few sunflower seeds for garnishing. Into a medium hot pan add oil. Once oil is hot add cumin. When cumin starts to splutter add ginger julienes and sliced chilies saute them once ginger loses its rawness add sliced onions add turmeric and mix well add salt just enough for the onions to get cooked cover with a lid and cook for about 5 minutes once onions turn transparent add sliced capsicum here i have added red yellow and green capsicum in equal amounts different colored capsicum have unique nutritional values in general capsicum is loaded with vitamins and is rich in fiber add paneer right away Paneer is a rich protein source for vegetarians. Calcium and magnesium add to its nutritional index. Mix and let it cook for few minutes. Now, in about 30 ml water, mix dry mango powder, chaat masala and coriander powder. Sprinkle this mixture on the vegetables. Sprinkling in this manner helps masala spread uniformly rather than directly adding these seasoning powders. Make sure you mix the powder in just enough water. Add salt to taste and mix well. Please keep in mind that chaat masala might have salt in it. Cook with the lid on for about 5 minutes till capsicum is just cooked. This recipe comes out well when the vegetables are crunchy. If you like them softer, then cook for some more time with the lid on. Keep stirring occasionally. Here you can see that capsicum pieces are cooked yet crunchy. Now this quick and easy preparation is done. Garnish it with sunflower seeds or any nuts of your choice. This step is optional. Just before turning off the gas, sprinkle a little more chaat masala. This is what makes this dish chatpata. You can eat it with rice, roti, wrap, bread or just by itself. Doesn't it look vivid? This recipe is a delight for the eyes and the palate. This is the kind of party I would love to attend. It takes about 10 to 15 minutes to cook this recipe. It takes even less time to finish it off. Cook wise, eat wise and be calorie wise. For more such exciting recipes, subscribe to Yam Chanted. Please like and share Yam Chanted videos. Keep in touch through your comments. See you in my next video. Bye.